Welcome to Herald of Glory Devotional. Today is Saturday, June 24, 2023. The Lord's Word to us talks about the spirit of reality. John chapter 16, verse 13 reads, Howbeit when he, the spirit of truth, is come, he will guide you into all truth. For he shall not speak of himself, but whatsoever he shall hear, that shall he speak, and he will show you things to come. Pastor says, understand that the Holy Spirit is in your life will not just give you a nice feeling, but to make your life complete and perfect. The Bible calls him the spirit of truth, reality. Jesus said, Howbeit, when he, the spirit of truth, has come, he will guide you into all truth. John chapter 16, verse 13. The Holy Spirit is the one who makes real and presence of the Father in Jesus to you. He's the one who brought into you the realities of your salvation in Christ. He gave birth to you as a new creation. Jesus said, That which is born of the flesh is flesh, and that which is born of the spirit is spirit. This is in John chapter 3, verse 6. The Holy Spirit is the spirit of glory. 1 Peter chapter 4, verse 14. He's the glory of God in you. He's the Christ in you. Paul said, Christ in you, the hope of glory. Colossians chapter 1 verse 27. You have been glorified with God's life and presence. God lives in you in the fullness of his glory and beauty. The Holy Spirit in you is the glory and the beauty of God in your life as a Christian. He is the anointing in you. He brought into you the grace and power of God. Jesus said, But ye shall receive power after that the Holy Spirit is come upon you. Acts chapter 1 verse 8. Isaiah chapter 11 verse 1 and 2 describes the dimensions and ministry of the Holy Spirit in the life and ministry of Jesus the Messiah. And there shall come forth a rod out of the stem of Jesse, and a branch shall grow out of his roots, and the Spirit of the Lord shall rest upon him, the Spirit of wisdom and understanding, the Spirit of counsel and might, the Spirit of knowledge and of the fear of the Lord. This in Acts chapter 11, verse 1 to 2. Today, we are partakers of Christ and joint us with Him. We've been anointed with the fullness of the Spirit. 2 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 21, the Amplified Classic Bible edition says, But it is God who confirms and makes us steadfast and establishes us in joint fellowship with you in Christ and has consecrated and anointed us Enduring us with the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Please make this declaration with me. The Holy Spirit in me is the spirit of glory and reality. I'm full of the glory and beauty of God my Father. I'm filled with the spirit of the Lord. The spirit of wisdom and understanding. The spirit of counsel and might. The spirit of knowledge and of the fear of the Lord. I am anointed of God. Hallelujah. As your reflection, know that as a Christian, you are already anointed with the Holy Spirit. We then reflect on Isaiah chapter 11 verse 1 to 3. And Herald of Glory Devotional, every day is a perfect day. Pastor Julius G. Christ Lord, Herald in the Glorious Church.